Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an update on my panels eyeshadows. Okay, so this is update number five in my panels eyeshadow series. Now, honestly, this is going to be a really short video because there's not a lot to update on because I'm so uninspired by my color palette that I'm barely using my shadows. So let's just get right into it. Okay, so like I said, I'm very uninspired, so there's not a lot of progress on anything. The first shade is Ruler Breaker from my Milk Cosmetics palette, Impulsive. There's the shade right there. I used this shade three times. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't know what to say about it. I, I don't know what to do. Okay, so, yeah, um, this shade and I think one other shade I've had it since the very beginning. And I started this project in August. I'm pretty sure. Let me check. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I started in August. So I've had this in here for five months, I think. I don't know. I'm getting confused by the months and the updates. But um, I think I'm going to keep this shade and Nefertiti, the next shadow, in here for one more month. And then it would have been half a year. And if I don't hit pan, then... I'm just going to roll it out and roll some more shades in because it's not fun using these colors. I don't get joy out of it. I'm not inspired by them. And yeah. <laughs> the next shade was Nefertiti for my... What is this? The Nubian 2 by Juvia's Place. That gold shade. There's literally no progress on this because I've used it zero times since the last update. So... It's the same dip as there was last time. No progress at all. The third shade was Iman from the Saharan by Juvia's Place. And I used this shade twice. That white shade right there. I just, I'm just so bored with these colors. I don't, I don't, I don't even want to use them. I don't know what to do with them. And that's it. Now this is, <laughs> I hit paint on one shade, and it's from the crown palette, from the one that we got from BoxyCharm, I just called it number 8, but as you can see there's some very visible pan, I used this shade one time before I hit pan because I knew I was going to hit pan on this next update, I knew I was going to hit pan because the um, dip was so deep, and it took one more use and then I hit it. So at least I get to roll one new shade in. I got a little bit of progress. The last shade was Candid from my Give It To Me Straight palette from Colourpop. It's this shade right there. And I used it one time. Okay, I kind of have an excuse though. Because in the last update I said that my hours at work were 7am to whatever. So I had to get up at 5. No, 5.40ish, 6 o'clock to get there on time. But this past couple of weeks, I've had to be at work at 6 a.m. So I've had to get up at 4.45 or 5 a.m. So the little amount of makeup that I was wearing to work, I just, I haven't been able to do it at all the past couple of weeks. But luckily, um, this coming up week at work, I work 7 a.m. to whenever and then 8 a.m. to whenever. So hopefully I'll get a little bit more progress this week. So yeah, that's all I can say about that. Um, I had no bonus pan this month. Just not really done a lot of anything, to be honest. Okay, but now it's time to get my Google Doc up. And to take that shade from the Crown Pro palette out. Oh my gosh, and then roll in a new shade. Okay, so I now have 681 pans of eyeshadow without without pan in them. So it's time to roll in a new shade. Let me get my pretty random app going. So the minimum is one and the maximum is 681. And the number I got is 447. Please be a shade that saves me. 
Okay, the Masquerade Mini Palette from Juvia's Lace. BRB. Okay, 447, was it 447? Is the shade Molly. <laughs> oh my gosh. And the shade Molly is this green metallic right there. So that's going to be fun to play with in the springtime because spring's coming up. So I'm honestly excited for this shade, not going to lie. Um, am I going to be able to hit pan though? I don't know. I mean, shades like this will be fun to like pop in the inner corner or throw all over the lid with like some browns and just have a fun eye look. So honestly, I feel like I might get more use out of this than that gold shimmer from the other Juvia's Place palette, or that white shimmer. I'm really excited. Maybe I'll get some more use out of that um, white shade Iman with, with this green shade. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what I can do with it. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to get some swatches up, and then that'll be the end of the video. <laughs> Okay, so here's the swatches of my new color palette for this month. So we have Rule Breaker from my Impulsive Palette from Milk Cosmetics, Nefertiti from Nubian 2 by Juvia's Place, Yvonne from The Sahara by Juvia's Place, Candid from Give It To Me Straight by ColourPop, and then Mally Molly from The Masquerade Mini by Juvia's Place. I'm really excited. This green shade was everything I needed to get re-inspired to use these um, eyeshadows for my project. So yeah, um, there's going to be a lot going on in the next update because either I'm going to hit pan and rule breaker, that's the closest shade in this project that I'm like, closest to hitting pan on. And it would be great if I did, but honestly either way if I don't hit pan I'm still rolling it out and I'm still rolling out. Um, Nefertiti from the Ju or the Saharan palette, the Nubian 2 palette. So yeah, um, make sure you tune in next month because there's gonna be a lot going on. That was so cringy. Okay. Um, please like, please subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you next time. Bye!